A renewed push to tackle gender issues in the North Carolina General Assembly. Today, a House committee is looking to ban gender affirming care for transgender kids, while the Senate looks to pass a revised plan that would ban transgender athletes from playing on women's sports teams. Two issues that have been up for debate for months. Wake Up Charlotte's Tradisha Woodard joins us now with all the details. Tradisha. Good morning, Sarah. North Carolina lawmakers have two committee hearings this week that will prevent health care facilities or health care providers from giving things like puberty blockers or performing surgical gender transition procedures to minors. Starting today, the House Health Committee will hear proposals that would ban any hospitals or health care providers from providing any gender affirming medical care to anyone under 18 years of age, including hormone treatment. The bills would also ban gender affirming hormone therapy, gender affirming counseling, and would block the use of state funds to pay for such care. Over in the Senate, the legislative body looking to pass changes to a bill that would ban transgender women from participating in female sports. This bill ensures that equality will continue in sports. But some worry the legislation could have a big impact on mental health. My daughter definitely has suffered from depression. She has been suicidal in the past. Even when ju this just legislation started to come out and we started hearing about it, it really upset her. Others say it's important to make sure fair competition is maintained. And Senate is expected to vote on the House version of the Fairness and Women's Sports Act today. We'll be sure to keep you updated of any changes. Sarah.